We're going to talk today about a subject that a lot of people are turning to cannabis for, and that's cannabis to treat neuropathy or neuropathic pain. Sometimes they call it peripheral neuropathy, but it's not only peripheral, which is in your hands and feet. This is a problem that many older people encounter as they age. Sometimes the nerves to the hands and feet start becoming less healthy the soonest because they're the furthest from their nerve center. Uh, peripheral neuropathy can also happen from diabetes and from other issues where the circulation to the hands and feet is impaired. And then central neuropathy can occur in a lot of neurological conditions, but the main result is that your nerves tingle and burn, and it's really, if not annoying, downright painful. And usually it's a progressive, ongoing, chronic problem. There are medications for this, and they generally stop working after a while. So <clears throat> people are really looking to cannabis as a treatment for peripheral neuropathy or neuropathic pain. And it's been shown that both THC and CBD are effective for these conditions for neuropathy because they're both neuroprotectant. That means they actually reverse nerve decay and stop it from progressing. The problem with this neuropathy is that since it's an ongoing chronic progressive problem, sometimes the best you can hope for is for it not to get worse. For while the cannabis is stopping it from progressing, it might not take it away altogether, but I often caution my patients that if it's not getting worse, we're really ahead of the game. You do need to use pretty high doses, but fortunately it can be a CBD or THC or mix that's useful. And you're looking at using up to 25 milligrams three times a day for an indefinite period of time, because if you have a chronic progressive condition, you have to keep treating it. So your best bet is a CBD THC one-to-one -one mix. You can get that in an edible or a tincture. Really inhalation is totally not gonna be effective for something this severe. You just can't get enough in your body. And some patients who really don't like the effects of THC do use a CBD rich type of product that is anywhere up to 95% CBD, 5% THC. That will work just as well at slowing down the progression of the disease, but it won't help the pain immediately as much. So the more THC you have, the better pain relief you have. Mm -hmm.